I finished my ride today. It was about 66 miles. Um, I'm at a KOA campground and I'm in a cabin, a little cabin. It was like $50 a night. And the reason is I couldn't get a campsite and I couldn't find any other alternative. So, but it turns out to be pretty cool. It's got bunk beds, <laughs> but it also has a queen bed over here. Maybe that's just a double, but it, it's kind of a, kind of a cool little cabin. It has heating and air conditioning. There's a bunch of people partying outside. It looks like some kind of drinking game. Uh, they're teenagers or whatever, young people. Here's the cabin from the outside. Um, so it was, a, it was a hard ride today. It took me a long time. I left uh, around 10 o'clock, didn't get here till about 5.30. Uh, mainly because a lot of hills and the hills were really steep. So uh, there was two of them I couldn't even get up. I, I, my, my front wheel would spin on the, on the asphalt, so I had to stop and push it up the hill. Um, it's one of the downsides of my front wheel drive. Uh, but it, these were really steep anyway. I would have barely made it up it uh, as it was. Um, and then just so many of them, it just seemed like they just kept coming. So, yeah, it just made the day go really slow and really long. But uh, it was cold and cloudy and misty and it sprinkled on me a little bit here and there but I didn't get poured on like I thought it was going to be so I was happy about that but I had to put on several layers and I and I I was fine but uh you know I could have used one more layer maybe um but uh you know it was uh it was otherwise the the roads were nice I didn't have a lot of traffic and uh um mostly followed the uh adventure cycling path rather than the Google Maps and uh, made it a longer trip today, but uh, at least I got better roads, I think. Um, I guess that's it. Um, yeah, so um, I, now I have to eat and set up, do my post and uh, party. <laughs>